Hello and welcome to the Game Dev Outpost. In this video, we'll be learning to navigate with the Windows command prompt. So when you open up the command prompt for the first time, you'll see the Windows version, and then you'll see the directory that you're in. And chances are it'll say users, and then who you are. For reference, in the normal file browser, it would look like this. Now, instead of navigating with the file browser, we'll be navigating with the command prompt. So in our command prompt, if we want to change our directories, or if we want to go into a subfolder, we need to type the command cd. And then after that, we want to type the folder that we want to go into. In this case, I'm going to do desktop. And then if we want to go back up a folder, we want to type cd dot dot. Now with that, we're also not restricted by moving one at a time. So we can type in cd, and then we can say desktop. And then if we know our subfolder, we can have backslash or forward slash. And then you can type out another subfolder that you know exists, and then hit enter. And just the same, if we want to go up multiple directories, we can type in cd dot dot slash dot dot. And now in this case, we're back where we start. Now, if you want to navigate to a subfolder and you don't know the exact name of it, you can type in cd space, and then you can hit tab, and this will tab through everything in that subfolder. And then if you hold down shift, it'll cycle backwards through those subfolders. You can also use tab for autocomplete. So you start writing out the folder and then you hit tab, it'll try and find that directory name. And then similar to that, if you want to just list out your directory options, you can just type in dir. Now you're not limited by the directory that you're in. You can also use this command to look at other directories. And you should notice that even though we got that information, we're still in the same directory on the desktop. Now, what if you want to switch between your drives? All you need to do is enter the drive letter or name and then a colon and then hit enter and you'll switch drives. Now, if you switch back to your previous drive, it remembers where you were before. And then if you wanna to get to the root of your drive right away, all you need to do is type in cd slash and you'll be in the root. Now there's a lot in the command prompt window right now. So to clear everything, we wanna type cls. It's all gone. Now there's a few more things to note. The commands cd, dir, and cls, the capitalization of it doesn't actually matter. You can have a lowercase or uppercase, whatever you want. It still does the same thing. It's not case sensitive. And then whenever I'm doing a slash, a forward slash, or a backslash, it doesn't matter in this situation. They're interpreted the same way. And then with navigation, you don't have to just navigate up and down. If you know the specific directory, you can type it out. And then last, a useful option that we have is copying and pasting. In the Windows command prompt, it's a little different. You can left click and drag to highlight what you want. And then if you right click, you'll copy it. And then if you right click again in the window, you'll paste. You can also do control V to paste. All right guys, that covers navigating in the Windows command prompt. If you guys thought this video was useful, please let me know by commenting down below and liking the video. Thanks guys.